Hey guys, it's Taylor. Thanks for joining. I'm gonna do um, a little tutorial, very quick, a classic red lip. If you want to tune in, continue watching, like and subscribe, share, um, leave comments of what you'd like to see next, and thank you for joining. how I have to line my lips when it comes to like bright colors especially red I'm a freak about it being very sharp and precise and I have very juicy <laughs> voluptuous lips so I don't always like to do a full outline when it comes to brighter colors because I don't know it just makes me feel a little clownish and not all the time is it gonna be considered that but we all have our opinion and that's how I feel so I am gonna get started I actually am just not dressed fully just decided to do this on the random and so don't judge me right now um, but stay tuned all right I'm back now I did my face really quick now let's jump into how I do my classic red lip um, specifically for girls with naturally juicy lips so personally, what I like to do is to take a deeper tone of red and go um, on the outer rim of my lips, shaping them exactly how I want it to be. And then I'm going to fill it in with a brighter red to go under um, the lipstick. So no matter what, no matter if I'm eating, drinking, anything, um, it will still have red um, lasting longer so that's what I'm gonna do now as you can see I did my um, foundation sort of bleeding into my lips I didn't really stop um, like right around my outer outline um, just so I can build my own outline as I want to with the liner um, today I'm gonna use the uh, Maybelline lipstick um, I have a few red lipsticks that I like a lot, but I just got this and I wanted to try it. Um, I did try it once and I was, you know, out and about so I didn't really pay attention, but I do know it's very creamy. So I'm going to be testing this time how creamy it is, um, if it's too creamy that it will transfer on every single thing or if it's still long lasting, that sort of thing. So let's go ahead and begin by the outline. Now this is the color Mahogany from NYX and then I'm going to fill it in with the color Plush Red um, and then the type of red from Maybelline Vivid Matte um, Liquid is, oh I think I, Rebel Red. So those are the names. Um, as for any rules really to lining the lips, I don't really have any rules but, or any guidelines I should say. What I just try to do is still accentuate like the like velocity or the volume of my lip, but not so much the width or um, just very sharp and clean versus rounded. Um, so as you can see, I sort of went outside on this side because I feel like this side has a, a wider point than this side does. So. Um, I'm just sort of accentuating this side to match the other and when I get to this point I go straight up to make that straight corner. If you can notice my lip is more rounded and this is more straight. And always remember you can go back and clean up with concealer. <laughs> That's usually my saving grace.
Now you don't want to like smudge too much or you're going to ruin your outline. So I try to keep it pretty, pretty careful. I'm going to go ahead and clean up before I fill it with the actual lipstick. baked yet so like I'm very dewy which I am usually never dewy so this is really bothering me but I wanted to do this before I bake and show you the finished thing sometimes I'll do my lips after baking but switch it up you know so let's apply the lipstick Almost perfect. I'm gonna use the liner actually to fix what I'm looking at. Just like brows, I could spend forever like really making it perfect. But just remember like you're up in your face. People aren't going to be really up in your face that close, so <laughs> doesn't always have to be exactly perfect, just perfect enough, you know what I mean? Now, because it is super creamy and I am going somewhere, I'm going to put a little clear powder over it to matte it really down. Um, like my other fave, which would be Ruby Rue by MAC. I don't know why I just spaced. And also, I'm completely spacing. The other favorite red is by ColourPop, and it's the feature with I Love Set Ye. And I forgot the freaking co the color's name. I love that red lipstick on your teeth. That's the, you know, that's when you know you've done a red lip right. <laughs> that is basically it for the day um, for me. And I'm glad that you joined me. I hope that I taught you a little something about the classic red lip. That I love but yeah if you have any questions suggestions leave them down below like and subscribe and I'll see you next time thanks <laughs>